Let's look for a high of 45 today. Winds out of the west at 10 to 15. So just a little bit on the breezy side. For tonight, more of the same. Through midnight, we've got clear skies out there, mostly clear, then becoming partly cloudy after midnight. As you can see, some clouds sinking in from north to south. Look for a low of 30 tonight. Winds west-southwest staying at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Actually a bit above average. Our average low is now right around 28 degrees. A little bit cloudier tomorrow, not completely overcast, but as you can see, especially from Grand Rapids to the north. Clouds a little bit more prevalent on your Thursday, and they'll hang on into Friday morning, it looks like. Uh, but as we head into the later morning hours on Friday and into the afternoon, we'll start to see more sun break through again. Now we showed you the winds just a moment ago, the current winds between 10 and 15 miles an hour. That doesn't really change this afternoon. Still could see some gusts upwards of 20 as well. And for tomorrow, as you can see here at 7 a.m., still a bit on the breezy side, and it looks a little bit breezy as we head into the afternoon as well. Winds generally from the west and southwest tonight, tomorrow, and on Friday. As we take a look at your Fox 17 seven day planner, pretty quiet weather here overall. 41 degrees on Thursday, a low of 32 on Thursday night and Friday's high up around 40. Some flurries possible in the morning and maybe a few actual snow showers dropping a dusting of accumulation north of I-96. But again, nothing major. Saturday looks mostly cloudy, 39 degrees. A chance of a few snow showers on Sunday, but again, not much of any accumulation expected. And then for Monday and Tuesday of next week, highs centered near 40 with lows in the upper 20s and no rain or snowfall for early next week.